show. What's up? 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 Welcome to What's Up. My name is Roger Jadling, and today we're interviewing Leela McNaff, who I hear has five ponies. Hi, what's your name? Leela McNaff. And when was the first time you encountered a horse or a pony? Oh, when I was little, maybe five years old. And how come you decided to um, raise five of them? Well, I started out wanting to do pony parties, and that didn't work. And then my daughter joined a miniature horse 4-H group, and we seemed to just get one after another. <laughs> what are your ponies' names? Uh, I have Blackberry, Daisy, Liberty, Honey, and Biscuit. And what are each of their ages? Oh, black, they're huge range. Blackberry's about 30, Daisy's about 26, Honey's 15, Liberty, we believe, is 22, and Biscuit's 11. And how would you describe your ponies as, like, how does they act? Oh, they're really good ponies. They're well-behaved. They're pleasant to be around. They love having visitors. So I think I have some pretty nice ponies. And why do you take them to competitions? What kind of competitions are they? They are driving competitions. Some of them are based on speed, and some of them are based on presentation, how pretty you are and how well your pony goes in the carriage. And sometimes we even compete against full-size horses. And where do you take your ponies like, to like, get some fresh air? Well, occasionally we'll drive at Borderland or at the state hospital grounds in Rentham. And how much times a week or like how much off how often do they go outside? They are always outside. They always have the option of going inside to get out of the weather or the bugs, but they live outside all the time. All right. And when was your first pony? We got Blackberry when she was about 15 and that was 16 years ago. And how was it like taking care of five of them? It's actually pretty easy. They don't take that much time because I have a pretty good system. So they're, they're a lot of fun to be around. They're always pleasant, and being out here is not a chore. And was it difficult finding a house for like to raise five ponies? It was. When we bought the house, I had one horse, and it took us a long time to find something, but we were lucky to stay in Foxborough and find this place. And how do you take care of your ponies? How do I take care of them? Well, you know, I take care of them by keeping them clean, keeping them fed, making sure they have plenty of fresh water, shelter from the weather, and they pretty much take care of themselves. Do people like come to visit your ponies a lot? They do. A lot of my friends bring their children, and a lot of my neighbors, when they're finding nothing to do, will come down and visit the ponies. Sometimes they bring carrots, so ponies love that. And what do ponies mostly eat? A lot of hay. They eat a lot of hay, a little bit of grain, and sometimes some treats, apples or carrots. And do you take your ponies to any, like, shows or any, like, events? I do. I do carriage driving shows um, in Springfield, New Hampshire, southern Massachusetts. So we try to do as many of those as we can. And when is your next show? My next show is September 17th in New Hampshire. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for watching What's Up. My name is Roger Jatling, and we'll see you in the next video.